Once, this papyrus shop in Luxor would have been bustling with tourists at this time of year, eager to take home some depictions of Egyptian heritage to hang on their walls. Winter is typically the busiest time of the year for shops in the southern Egyptian town. But on this day, this shop is empty. Periods of unrest and violence have kept crowds of tourists away. But retailers like Said Maghrabi are optimistic about 2017. People working in the tourism industry, we are the ones who have been harmed the most in the period following the revolution. But God willing, the blessings are still coming and things will get better for Egypt. The winter season is clouded with an extra tinge of tragedy. On Sunday, a suicide bombing struck a Coptic church in central Cairo, killing 25 people. ISIL claimed responsibility. But this hasn't deterred some tourists. Yang Siliu, a 23-year-old Chinese university student visiting Luxor with a tour group, says she feels safe on her trip, despite recent headlines. Actually, uh, my mom was a little bit concerned about like the safety, but actually, um, when you arrive here, it's feel, you feel safe. It's completely different from like the news and all the bomb. Like, yeah. So it's. I think it's safe here. Yeah. Restaurant owner Faraj Osman says the events were troubling, but he doesn't think it's a problem only experienced by Egypt. <laughs> These attacks could have been anywhere in the world, in America, England, France, Belgium, any place. Luxor and Aswan have over the past few years seen the most booking cost hikes among all Egyptian tourism cities. Maria Galang, CGTN.